I'm all about to find my cure, everybody. Welcome in again to the Anako Oho. Today's day are just coming in. Um, I'm my heart of my fucker toe, mate. And the Hiana Kia Koto Mutu Toi Toki Tene Kopapa. And just the Miki for you coming in and um, just supporting the whole Kopapa. Always nice to see um, Pana coming in and just sharing energy in the space just for the hour. It's just three times a week. Quite a simple, um, just a simple process for us in these ones. Uh, we'll just start with our karakia and then we'll um, get into our mahi. Okay. Tuki do it, tuki tuki ro, tuki ko tuki na tu tenei, tuki ko tu tuki na runga uwe uwe te mana. Kainga tāne ki tāko to kei raro, kainga mano i rungi raro tāko ki te tuki nei. Ka pa te tuki kei Hawaii ka i tapu ka noa tēnā, te hau ko te hau o tū. Te hau o tāwhiri mā te a wārea ki runga wārea ki raro tāko to. Tūru whakamaua ki a tēnā, tēnā, hau mi e kui e tāi ki e. Um, again, just welcome everybody into our space. Um, just a bit mindful about the other end that's sort of drifting out over past, um, a little bit out past seven. And I know some of the whānau have, um, you know, tamariki and everyone that's sort of rising at those times. So we will just sort of move into it a little bit quicker in the morning. Especially now we're adding a little bit more rako. Um, and just uh, reiterate on the corridor on Monday, just about lining the three hearts. So that meditation that we're sort of uh, drifting into now is really breathing breath into those, igniting them and just lining them back up. That sit through the center, that straight, that straight um, energy channel that sits through the center of the tinana. <clears throat> so just bringing the whatu manawa and the manawa and the pū manawa back into line when things kind of happen around us, especially emotional things, things that affect us, it can kind of knock us out of balance, you know, when we start moving into other uh, ways of being, other ways of like surviving, negotiating, controlling, all of that sort of stuff. Um, so the pū manawa, just lining that back in with the, uh, with the living heart, the balanced heart, and also our, um, you know, our all-seeing heart, our spiritual place. When we're breathing, taking breath into the Fatu Manoa, more sitting into the center of the Upoko. So we sort of, uh, what do you call it? Um, like the pineal gland or the mind's eye, or um, there are many different kind of uh, ways that people express their place. Um, the Manoa, breathing breath into the heart, opening the heart, igniting that space. You know, and that brings, uh, you always feel like elevated emotions, bringing those things, what are we really um, about, how is our pathway, what are we on, what, are we, uh, what is on our pathway. Pū manawa, our emotional house, clearing, just bringing breath through those places. Um, Pū ngao, just being aware of our universal energy, our ihiranga ranga, what vibration are we bringing to our spaces, and iarere, what, what frequencies are we broadcasting out, because they will be broadcasted back. <clears throat> it's kind of the energy of the thought pushes it out, the feeling draws it back to us. So just to be mindful of those and just to, you know, let go of the resistance that sometimes happen, happening, because we can't, you know, out of these sort of spaces, we don't think our way up, we feel our way up. So it's, um, you know, our analytical mind can take over a lot of times and sort of start trying to negotiate, analyze, um, do the mathematics of the whole thing, but really only uh, suitable for, you know, uh, certain parts in our environment, not not this kind of mahi. We really want to kind of, when things are coming up, to feel our way up as opposed to analytically thinking our way up. Awesome. So in saying that, we should jump into the mahi because I know the other ends are getting a little bit longer and sort of pushing out past seven, like I was saying, especially finally that have sort of things happening. After seven, those who are just coming in, my 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 welcome in, just relax, come into our space, just share the journey for an hour, see how it resonates with you, and just encourage to make it a practice. Bring your rako, a bit of water if you need it. If you're sitting cross-legged, just elevate yourself a little bit, it helps with this position. If you're not used to it, 
otherwise uh, leg straight out in the B position and just follow through with the same warm ups. Same opening the tinana, just getting our blood flowing, our energy moving through all our system and waking all the systems up. Leaving more holistic or leaving more whole when we leave our space. Help I find your space. It's coming in. Haki roto. Haki wako. Just keeping the back straight, the back erect. Dropping our chin to our chest. Just starting to open up through the top of the spine. Remember that you're getting out. We need to open up this channel. Toru, Ua, Tahi, Piti, Kilo Kiloba. Looking towards the rangi, towards the ceiling, the sky. Stretching and opening the throat. This would be the communication chakra if you were talking in chakra language. Our vocal expression. Toru, Ua, Tahi, back to center. Again, left ear to the left shoulder. The arm up if you need more of a stretch. Stretching down the side of the kaki onto the shoulder. Just keep the head pointing straight. Eyes straight ahead. Toru, Ua, Tahi. Right foot to fifty. Right ear to the right shoulder. Stack it across the other side. Down onto the shoulders. Especially through the kaki, a lot happens through here. Toru, Ua, Taki, back to center. Titiroki Maui. Just driving our chin over our left shoulder, dropping the eyes onto the floor, elongating and stretching the opposite side of the kaki. Toru, Ua, Taki, number 50. Sit over the right shoulder, dropping the eyes behind the shoulder onto the floor. And stretching, opening the other opposite side. One way through there. Toru, Ua, Taki, back to center. Just drop the chin again to the chest and just roll the upoko, the chin to the left shoulder. Go right around at this stage and then back across the front of the chest, up onto the right shoulder, maki pene. Just to bring movement through here. Just open all of that together. Three more. Tahi. Ua, Toru, back to center, Hakiroto, Hakiwako, moving forward, walking our teeth on the forward on the fingertips if that helps, or stretching out the arms, the hands onto the floor, drop the upopo, stretching through the arms and the shoulders, and down through the center of the back. Pushing the stretch further down the tinana now. Down through the spine into the lower back. Down into the glutes if you're sitting cross-legged. Toru, you are Tahi. Back up to center. Hakiroto. Hakiwako. To the same position, just a little bit deeper. Do 
will lead to straight into medial femoris all through the hamstring area, down the back of the legs, also into the lower back. Just try and go a little bit further on the second stretch. Focusing on your breath, keep that moving. Just try and relax the body as much as possible. Toru, you are Kagi. Back up to center. Hakiroto. Hakiwako. Right chin to the right knee. Starting to open up through the side of the spine, moving around the side of the T number. Try and maintain a relaxed T number. Just feel the breath flowing in and out. Just be mindful of that. Try not to hold the breath. Feel this more into the side of the glutes, side of the lower back. Toru, Ua, Tahi. Back up to centre. Hakiroto, Hakiwaho. Into the left knee. Up the other side of the spine, the other side of the back, down onto the side of the hip. Just relax and let your body weight fall into its position. Just try not to force anything. Oru, Ua, Tabi, back up to centre. Doing our elbows to the floors and opening up all through the lats and opening up the ribs. Right elbow to the floor. Yeah. Bring the arm up if you need to. Just try and relax the T number. Keep the shoulder back. We're just stretching and opening up down through the side of the ribs, side of the T number. You can feel this all the way down onto the side of the hook bit. Really good for anything we're doing, but particular if we uh, do a lot of sitting, if we're at a computer or on our laptops or at desks, it's so really good for those spaces just to keep our posture well. Toru, Rua, Tahi, Vicenta, Okafiti, left elbow to the floor, put your other arm over the top. See a lot of people have the standing desks these days or Swiss balls, sitting on Swiss balls. You have the fun of having desks that you have to stand at. Oru, Ua, Taki, back up to center. Everybody's getting a bit more aware about posture and things. Right, let's come into our space. Take your breath, deep breath in, deep breath out, start to relax the body, close the eyes, arms facing each other, now it's a lot to take in, just be mindful of the energy that comes through our, the palms of our hands, so we're holding a ball. the body up through the back of the neck. Keep the back erect and straight through the scalp, down through the forehead, and through the eyes, the cheeks, past the nose, around the lips. Relax your jaw. Relaxing down through the corpta, through the throat, onto the shoulders. Just release, relax.
relaxing down through the shoulders, through the arms, elbows, the forearms, through the hands to the tips of your fingers. Release, relax. Drop your shoulders. Just coming into a more peaceful, calm space. Relaxing through the chest, through the upper back and shoulder blades. through the solar plex, the upper puku, relaxing through the center of the back. Relax down into the lower puku, down into the lower back, to the lower part of the spine. Release, relax. Take note of the different feeling that are pulsating through the palms and how that changes. Relaxing down through the hope, through the uri, from around the waist area of the hips, through to the top of the legs, <coughs> down through the knees. the calves, to the ankles, along through the feet, <coughs> all the way to the tips of the toes, relax, release. Start to elongate the breath. Bring your attention to your breath. Longer, slower, and deeper. Bring your attention to the three hearts, the Pumanoa, center of the Puku. The Manoa, center of the chest living heart the Fatu Manoa the all seeing heart mind's eye center of the Upoku Now three breaths into the Fatu Manoa. Hakiroto. Nice long, slow, deep breath. Acknowledging the Fatu Manoa. Release the breath through the mouth. Kiroto, present with the breath, feel the breeze of your breath, floating into the Fatimanoa.
contained in this energy center. Release your breath. Relax your space. Attention to the manua, the center chest, the rako manua, to the breath, into the heart, rakiwako. Stay present, stay focused. Hakiroto, second breath. Feel the breeze of your breath into the heart. Hakiwako. Kiroto. Just follow the breath into the center of your heart. Feel the breeze. Caress this energy center. Akiwako. Manawa, Manawa to line, drawing three breaths into both hearts at the same time, simultaneously, Hakiroto. Attention to the Pu Manoa, the center of the Puku, the Pito. Hakiroto. <coughs> Into the emotional house, the Pu Manoa. Feel the breeze of your breath. Into the house of emotions, our Pu Manoa. Hakiwaho. Center and balancing this place, Hakiroto. Elongate the breath into the puku, the pumanoa. Hakiwaho, release the breath. Hakiroto. Feel a breeze into the house of the Pumanoa. Release 
you still breathing? Bring that put manawa into line with the manawa and fatu manawa. Three breaths simultaneously into our three heart centers. Aligning our space, heart kiroto. Feel the breath into the three hearts at the same time. Akiroto, our last breath, simultaneously into the three hearts. Hearts from our base, our uri, from the base of the spine, all the way to the top of the upoko, to our pumotomoto, or our crown. Hakiroto, pull the breath up, keep the back erect, follow the breath, feel its breathe, breath move through the three hearts. Hold at the crown. Three, two, one. Release your breath. Ano ha kiroto. Bring our breath up through the three hearts in a straight line, following the energy channel. Line hearts holding at the crown. Three, two, one. Release your breath. No ha kiroto. Feel the breeze of your breath move through your tinana. Through the energy centers, through the three hearts, aligning them, holding at the crown. Three, two, one. Release your breath. Kiroto, Akiwaho, feeling the breath moving through the aligned hearts. By deep breath in. Slowly bringing the awareness back to the body, back to the Tinana. Really open your eyes, holding the state, slowly moving to our standing position for our Koti Pito.
starting in their east direction to Taira Fiti. Find your position. <coughs> Legs a little bit wider than the hips. Takiroto. Takiwaho. Drawing the breath through the feet, through the heels, all the way up through the tinana. Hakiwaho. Ano hakiroto. Hakiwaho. Otipito. Beginning our physical movement. Tu fera mai ki arangi nui. Ha moa ki a papatu anuku. Return to your centre, ko te pito. Kukia te mauri. Brace your life force. Hei oranga wairua. Hei oranga hiningaro. Hei oranga tinana. Hei oranga whāna. Ko te pito. Te tu tama tāne. Te tu tama wahine. Turn up to the balance center, the feminine, the masculine. Oki whakamuri. E a ngā atu ki ngā tūpuna. Hei oranga. O ngā uri. Waka heke. Ko te pito. Creating wellness for our generations that are to come. Tūpuna ta mauri te hei. From our tai rā whiti. Uri ki te tai tonga. Hākina, start accentuating the movements, waking the body up, hākuta, hākina, hākuta, hākina, feel the breath, feel the whole tinama, hākuta, activation, ko te pito, tu whera mai kia rangi nui, Stretch and reach for Papa. Rangi. Ta mau waki a Papa tuanuku. Niti a Papa. Ko te pito. Pouring ourselves in the world of light. Tuti a te mauri. Hei oranga wairua. Hei oranga hininga. Hei oranga tīnama. Hei oranga whānu. Ko te pito. Titu tama tāne, titu tama wahine, ko te pito, o ki whakamuri, ko atu ki ngā tūpuna, hei oranga, be well, o ngauri, waka heke, ko our generations that are to come, always return to your centre, ko te pito. Tukuna ta mauri i ti hei E mā tai tonga Uri E tai haua u Hākina Hākuta Hākina Hākuta Hākina Hākuta Ko te pito Ti o seta Tu whera mai kia rangi nui. Tā mō waki a pupatu anuku. Ko te pito, te o seta. Tu te a te mauri. Hei o ranga wairua. Hei o ranga hiningaru. Hei o ranga tīnana. Hei o ranga whāna. Ko te pito, te o seta. Pe tu tamatā. Tu tama wahine O te pito You turn to the balance center Your masculine, your feminine O ki whakamuri Ka ngā tu ki ngā tūpuna Hei oranga Mu ngauri Baka heke Ko te pito Tu kuna tamauri Te hei Ma ngā hua uru Uri ki te tai tokarau Hākina, 
Rápida. 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 Tu feras mai que a rogue de lui. Rapo a qui a papa tu a de coup. The space of wellness for our generations that are to come. To Kanata Mauri, Ti Hei, Wai Hakina, Hapunta, Hakina, Hapunta, Hakina, Hapunta. Eyes closed, face your palms forward. Put your shoulders back to Jouukoko. Tilt the head as if you're looking to the rising sun. Acknowledge the balance center that runs through the center of your tinama, through the center of yourself. Creating the well space for our generations that are to come, for our whaka papa, will keep moving through the world of light. Feel the energy from your palms. Kiroto Hakiwaho. Slowly opening our eyes, bringing down Hako. We have knuckle to knuckle this week. Skipping up onto our Hako. So when you're ready, from under the knuckle, under the big toe, across the knuckles. Under the ball of the feet, stepping onto our rako, slowly bringing our pressure forward. It's gonna have a good bite sometimes, this one. And just to where you're starting to wake yourself, wake the systems up, feel the pressure coming through the feet, through the high mat up, drawing the heels up, you'll feel the pressure move towards the front of the feet. It's like being in the thieves if you need to. Just finding your point position where that is for you on your arco. And the pressure forward, taki, fua, toru, fa, lima, right up the haere, kimawi. Feel more pressure into the left wai wai. Again, mindful of the heel. Lifting, bringing the pressure to the front of the foot. Feeling the pressure running through the, the buckles of the feet. Tahi, Lua, Toru, Fa, Rima, right up the high end of the fifty. Cross to our right wild way. Mato. They lift the heels, bring the pressure in. That's why the other good one always to, you know, take our shoes off, our all our synthetic soles, reconnect with Papa, go for walking in our bare feet. Very good for our postures and our connection, our energy. Also clears us of a lot of things. Bye, Rima, Pa. 
Kuru, Kua, Tangi, Pakahaere, the centre, the last feel of pressure <coughs> coming forward. Let's feel that through the buckles, weakening all the internal systems, liver, heart, digestive tract, also our posture, Rima, Fa, Toru, Ua, Tahi. Slowly step off your arco. Just walk that out with your feet. Bring our short arco up when you're ready. We started this the other day. Just putting the hand to the middle of the arco. Right, maki pene. Circulating the wrist. The circulating the wrist. This is why the short rako is good. We can do other things that uh, makes it quite difficult on the long rako. It's not only helps the hand and through the wrist, through the forearms, but also strengthens and stretches right into the elbow area. We are count off tahi ua. Toru, Fa, Lima, Ono, Pitu, Waru, Iwa, Tako, Kapai, Pakafiti, Torako, change to our left hand, again circulating the wrist. One side is always, you know, we always lean into one side more than the other, so always good to do both sides just to balance our kinesthetic awareness. Again, you'll feel this through into the elbow, stretching. Also, probably through to the shoulder, holding the rako up for so long. Now, count off. Tahi, Rua, Toru, Ma, Rima, Ono, Fitu, Waru, Iwa, Tekau. Right, bring your rako up. Now, second one, just tapping the side your calves We're just coming up the side from the top of your ankles just light taps to begin with just so you start to become aware of your reach your tapping just all through the side so you get weary of the shin we're weary of the ankle bone right so we're starting at the bottom and doing five up and down right Taki, up to the base of the knee, Rua, Toru, Fa, Rima, right with our short Rako Pokafiti, other side, just moving up and down the side of the calf. Just stepping lightly just to begin with, just to get your Awareness about where this is tapping, we're starting to wake it up through here. From the bottom to the top, we'll do five. Tahi, Rua, Toru, Fa, Rima. Come on, bring our small rako, bring our long, long rako up. Some of the monkey with the short rako you can get a little bit, you need to get a bit used to it. Right, bring our hands wide. Maki pene, opening up through the shoulders. Come on, now the closer up with this mahi, the closer you bring your hands, the harder this one becomes. You start to open up more through these spaces, the closer your hands are. So we'll open up through our shoulders, to the top of the torso. Now count off. Tahi. Rua. Toru. Fa. Lima. Ono. Fitu. Waru. Iwa. Takau. 
we are locked up onto our shoulders. Have a hip here, mate. Just powering yourself. No pivoting off the ball of the foot yet. This just isolates our buggy, opening up through the chest, the shoulders. We practice this for us to keep up. Just keeps the tina on supple, keeps energy moving, helps stopping things from locking up like shoulder freeze, things like this. It's mindful of our energy moving, our count off. Tahi, Ua, Tori, Fa, Rima, Ono. Pitu, Oru, Iwa, the coat, the fight now, follow the eyes, pivot off the foot, right around, turning the whole torso. Now this is moving down through the spine, all the way into the hips, the lower back. Starting to open up the tinama. She'll be pivoting off their back foot. Being light on the feet. We'll count five on this one. Tahi. Rua. Toru. Va. Rima. Okay. Bring back to center. Just open up our kaki. Maki pende. Walking the rako up the back of the kaki. Walk it up to the base of the spine. At the base of the spine. Aroha mai, the base of the neck. The base of the skull. And this should be applying pressure through here. And just taking all the pressure out through here. All that thinking. Just relax through the kaki. Big energy highway. Kapai huri. Coming back the other way. Walking the rako back down the kaki. You feel the pressure. Around the mid and off, just off center around the kaki. Probably be one of my favorites. Just moving through here. Has quite a big effect on our shoulders down through our spine, through our alignment. Tahi, Rua, Tori, Fa, Rima, Kapai. Back to center, bring our rako over the top, acknowledging our breath. Breath out on the way down, draw the rako out through the front, draw the breath in. Haki wako. Hiroto. Aki wako. Hiroto. Aki wako. Aki roto. Aki wako. Just bring the rake to parallel. The waist, palms facing down. Five po yourself. Maki pene. Pushing the hands forward. Rowing the walk up. some more movement through the arms, opening up through the shoulder blades, movement through the tinama. We have count off. Tahi, Ua, Foru, Fa, Rima, Ono, Pitu, Waru, Iwa, Kakao, Kapai, elbows, pushing the elbows forward. Awesome, awesome. Just let the tea number flow where it needs to flow. We are count off. Tahi, Rua, Tori, Fa, Rima, Ono, Pitu, Waru, Iwa, Kako, Kako, bring our Rako parallel. Do you know, arms up, palms up. Bring back the other way. 
just do eyesight, eye height, tucking, Rua, Hori, Fa, Rima, Ono, Fitu, Waru, Iwa, Tako, by stage two, just pivot off the balls of the feet, pushing the raka out higher, more turn to the body. Count off, Tahi, Rua, Hori, Fa, Rima, Ono, Fitu, Waru, Iwa, Tako, if I bring our Arako back to centre, Riga Riga, your hint in the centre, number eight. Right, just to try and bring it in as close to the Tinana as you can. Let the Tinana move to its natural rhythm. Tahi, Rua, Kauru, Fa, Rima, Ono, Fitu, Waru, Iwa, Tekau, Waifaka Fiti, changing the hands to the left hand. Tahi, Rua, Kauru, Fa, Rima, Ono, Fitu, Waru, Iwa, Tekau. Awesome. Bring our Rako up to the centre. Round to the back, cross the lower back, rocking side to side, pull the pressure through the palms, your hands, pull forward, <coughs> just bring the rako across the lower back, begin to walk it up the spine, as far as you can go. Keep the pressure on the rako, pull down through the lower back, with the tinana to the side of the ribs. Coming down onto the lower back. Ima, Fa, Toru, Iwa, Kahi, Kapai, pivot on the back foot, drive the rako deeper, around onto the hope. Pivoting off that foot. Kahi. Rua. Kauru. Fa. Lima. Ono. Fitu. Waru. Iwa. Teko. Kapoi. Yaraka around to the front. <coughs> Push your arms down straight. Again, the step back, just dropping our upoko. Let's feel our stretch, feel the breath moving in and out of the tinama, just the tinama starting to settle. Feel the stretch through the arms, up through, down the back of the legs. Pākiroto, Pākiwaho, push the tinana out to the left side, opening the ribs, down through the back of the left waiwai, lima, pā, toru, rua, tai, right back to centre, Pākiroto, Pākiwaho, push the tinana out to the right side, You're expanding the ribs, opening up the tinana, stretching the back of the right leg. Tai, Ua, Koru, Fa, Ima, back to center, Akiroto, Akiwa. Slowly rising into our Fakata. <coughs> Bring our Rako parallel. Then palm facing down, right palm facing up, eyes closed. 
Haki roto pepefen Haki waho Just feel the energy pulsating Around and through the body Through the tinana Just acknowledging the energy The life force Is pulsating through you Thank you again everybody for coming in, just sharing some energy this morning, awesome to see everybody, awesome to see, uh, just giving some effort and energy into our own spaces, they're always nice to start the day like this, uh, nice to be up early and just uh, witness our coming into the daylight, watching our sunrises, um, and just lovely to share the space with everyone and just bring more of an awareness about our energy, our uh, ihiranga ranga, uh, iarere, you know, all these things that actually um, we always used to kind of really acknowledge live in those spaces, you know, a lot of this modern world has sort of pulled us into our internal uh, internal into our exterior uh, environments and kind of we live in those places a lot, so we really sort of you know, encourage our um, whanos to come back to the internal journey, to be really aware of these spaces, come back to living from the heart as opposed to the analytical mind. Um, and you'd be amazed at what sort of starts to show up, what sort of draws back into our spaces. And the influence that we have on all our tamariki and our generations that are to come. Again, wiki ana kia koutou katoa. Thank you for coming in the new whanau. Awesome. Have an awesome day, whanau. Kia pai tō rā. We will see you 